Oh yeah, okay, yeah. I've got it. So what is your name? Tobias Larson. And you're awfully... You have to move back so you can see I, how I, 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 Please, I'm doing the film. That's why I have the light. I notice you walking around. Now, you are tall to begin with. And then on top of that, you have these high heel... How how many how tall are you to begin with? Uh, I mean, I'm not a pygmy, contrary to what this uh, camera angle may imply. I'm five eight. How tall are you? I am six six. Six six, and that was not tall enough. Yeah, not tall enough. Can and, always be taller. And how many inches do these shoes add to your height? Oh uh, well, what do you say? Twelve? No, ten. Is how do they measure by the by the height? Is that hard? Are they hard to walk in? No, you, you practice. Can't you break you, an ankle? No, well, you could, but you know, if you practice, you, you, you'll get good at it. I mean, can, you can't. Can you dance? I mean, I, I, I've always wondered about high heels because they're, <laughs> they're so they're so uncomfortable, and yet so many people are fixated on them. Yeah. Women see them as the ultimate glamour. Yeah. You know, I've had drag queens sit next to me and say, "Oh, my feet are killing me." Yeah. I said, "Why do you use high heels?" And I say, because I can. Yeah, right. <laughs> it's fabulous. But you know, the trick for me was to have boots. Yeah. How high up do the boots come? Here. Oh, wow. So you're sort of protected. And what, si what size boot do you take? 14. Isn't that very large for, is that, that must be a woman's boot, right? Yeah. It's a 14 woman's boot. So that has to be custom made somewhere, right? Don't no, they, only they, go to they sell them in New York City. Oh, where? Where in New York? Uh, Union Square. Uh, I think Trash and Vaudeville might carry them. Oh, really? Uh, the Halloween store at Union Square carries now, them. Now, if, if you were to go, if somebody was not used to wearing these, say I was this side, I wanted to be taller. Yeah. Uh, wouldn't I really risk like breaking my neck? Well, on those? you would have to practice with somebody holding your hand at oh. first, and then you take slowly, one step at a time, oh. and then when you're and good at it... how long is it like riding a bicycle? Yeah, yeah. Or I mean, ice skating? It's like walking. Or, it's like walking. Really? Yeah. Are there other platform shoes that are really not with a spiked heel and high heels, but are just high, big platforms that people that just want to be taller, but not like... I mean, there you're sort of mixing genders. Well, I mean, if you were, like, say, a guy that was only five foot four and had a, a complex about it, you might want to add four or five inches. Yeah, well, I think this is a good place to look around and search. You might get lots but of inspiration. But do they make shoes like that as well? I have no idea. What I think so. I'm pretty sure. I haven't looked around for it. But where but do you wear these besides a place like the here? Uh, anywhere where you don't have to walk too much and when it's oh, good to be extra to, tall. Now how long can you actually walk on those before oh, your feet get tired? Like after like four, four hours, four or five hours. Oh really? Yeah. Is there something you build endurance for? It's like, yeah, I guess. I guess you get better. And how long yeah. have you been wearing? Now I just got here, so no, I'm about I'm saying, to get over long, and get some food. You, how long have you been wearing? I, oh, I see. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's, uh -huh. it's time for food oh, break before oh. I start my shift. Okay, okay. It was lovely talking to you. But I see you. that you broke your arm. I know, but that was has nothing that, to do with the shoes. Oh, it nothing. Okay, nothing. Okay, okay. You're, you're not guilty. Thank you.